Hey friends, welcome back to Vince and Gigi's Super Channel G. Look how incredibly amazing these bendable action figures look from the Sonic the Hedgehog and they're from Jack's Pacific Toys. I can't wait to show you just how incredible this unboxing was. We're gonna go ahead and get started with that. But before we get started, please follow us by clicking the subscribe button below. Hit the notification bell next to it so you can notified every time you have a new video come out. Talk to us in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Let us know where in the world you're watching from. And yeah, tell us which one of these you think are amazing. And then of course, click that share button to share this video with anyone who you think would think is amazing. So guys, why don't we go ahead and get started. Right now. So nice to meet you, Gigi. Super Channel G. Vince and Gigi. Super Channel G. Vince and Gigi from Super Channel G. Vince and Gigi from Super Channel G. I will see you on the TV. Uh. Congratulations on all your success. Super Channel G. All right, friends. Welcome back to Vince and Gigi Super Channel G. And look what we have for you here today. We have these brand new Sonic the Hedgehog action figures and really they're just bendable, posable figures. But either way, definitely absolutely super cool. And to be quite honest, they've actually been out about maybe about two months I would say. Well, maybe a little bit longer, maybe a little bit less. But we haven't gotten to these because I want to do them right before the movie came out. And that's what we're looking at here today. So there's both waves that came out. And of course, this first wave, let's just take a look real quick. This is Sonic, Knuckles, Tails, and Shadow. And if you'll notice, it comes with this little like mini spinner right here that can pop out or spin around. Like if you were doing a coin, this one comes with little mini Knuckles, Tails, Amy, and Sonic. And then if you look at wave two right here that features Dr. Robotnik, Dr. Eggman, we turn it around over here this has again this is the same sonic but with a different um little spinning figure right here which is tails we have supersonic metal sonic and dr eggman or dr robotnik and it's kind of cool because we notice this looks like this would be shadow this would be one of dr robotnik's uh, vehicles and then this is looks appears to be regular sonic so um we did not buy the duplicate sonic because the only difference is that little spinner. So we have otherwise the entire set of each one of the action figures. And just a quick look, we'll go ahead and get started with Sonic in just a moment. But look how great they look. Here's Tails. Let's see if I can get a, here's Knuckles. Here is Super Sonic. Ooh, here's Dr. Eggman, Metal Sonic, and Shadow. So right, let's jump right on in what do you say here we are my friends sonic the hedgehog let me bring our camera just a little bit closer and look how incredible this looks this is from jack's pacific toys so check out this package the package looks absolutely gorgeous and it's basically the same for all of them so it has this style right here it lets you know about this little spinnable disc right here this one comes with knuckles and it's kind of like this um, I guess 16-bit pixelated and right here look at this wonderful sonic picture right here and I can't wait to get them out so we can see exactly how bendable poseable these are okay so let's open them up all right let's see if we can get them open without completely destroying the package again so let's see what we got here We're able to yep Got a tiny little spot where we can just wedge this bad boy open. I'll just kind of shake this this way. So we can do the same this way. And this will keep it from just completely ripping open. Or at least it should, right? Here we are. And am I able to just pop him out? Almost there. There you go. There you go. Oh. 
Okay, cool. Man, this is a huge package for just this being in there. Look at that. Looks really cool. And you know what? I almost forgot to read the back. So let's take a look. We already saw this. But, ooh, and there is no write-up. For some reason, I was already remembering there was a write-up. And there isn't. Okay, so just to take a look. Bendable limbs. You can fold this and then spin it. All right, cool. So let's get them out. Let's take a look. So, well, let's get our, our spinning piece here. Let's pop our Sonic on out. And he definitely feels top heavy. Let's take a look at this. This is our Knuckles spinning disc, right? And it actually looks really neat. And it doesn't have any other instructions other than that. So I'm like, okay, we pull this out. And I guess that's it. All right? Look. <laughs> I guess that's it, right? And I'm like, hmm. This pops out this way, this pops out that way. And okay. And I would assume. This just goes here. Now we can have them stand. But anyway, go ahead and pop this back in. It's back in here. And then we will. Ooh, that didn't exactly go as planned. But. Well, doesn't roll as amazing as I thought it would, but still works. Look at that. Very cool, so we'll set that aside. And let's take a look at the Sonic, and the Sonic's head is definitely heavier than the rest of his body. But, let's see. His head does articulate, oh, you hear that? You hear that? So, I wonder if we can even get him to stand. I can get it to focus here. Look at that. So he uh, he does all right. <laughs> Let's get even closer here. But as we take a closer look, the head does articulate a little bit, moves side to side. I'm really liking the sculpt here. Look at this, and all this is kind of like a softer plastic. I like the way the face looks. The mouth's over here. Be nice if it was, had a little bit of black on there. Um, the arms do bend what appears to be pretty well. Look at that. I wonder if we can get a a really good elbow bend or not, which I can... Let's see. Ugh. There we go. So it's going to be like a curvy bend. Like that. All right. It does okay. Let's see. Both arms are kind of moving. What about if I do this? If I can bend this leg higher on the hip so that it'll look better. Look at that. So that's kind of cool. Look at his little tail. And we can bend this leg like this. How's that? I think that looks pretty cool. You can definitely have him give him a thumbs up while he runs by over here. Look at that. I wonder what it would look like if we put our action figure stand here. Let's zoom out. Ooh, everything just kind of went haywire there. <laughs> and, let's see if we can do this without Cap catching his hand. That's cool. And I just realized his tail was really what was stuck there. There we go. There we go. We can turn his head. Look at that. That looks pretty awesome. So, pretty cool actually. I'm digging it. And let's get him out of here. And I know I can't have them stand like this, but that's pretty awesome. Like the color scheme, 
we just have a little bit of issues with a little bit of paint bleeding right here. Look at that. Or kind of rushed around the armpit, in other words. But look at how this looks. This looks great. Look at his tail. We can probably um, look at his shoes too before I skip past that. So let's go ahead and spread his legs to stand a little bit better. And let's see if we can't get him to just kick back right there. How's that? There we go. All right, very cool. So we'll place him right over here. Hopefully he doesn't fall over, which he just did. <laughs> oh man, that was brutal. <laughs> His head just went. Okay, that should be fine. Okay, great. So let's move on to our next figure. What do you say about that? And you know what? I was going to go in order, but I changed my mind. Because the movie's about to come out, I'm really excited about Jim Carrey being Dr. Robotnik. So, Dr. Eggman, unbelievable. Let's go ahead and get him open. Look at his legs and his little, um, the way they set him up here it looks really cool. All right. Get him on open. Let's do kind of the same thing. Just backwards here. Let's kind of shimmy this this way. All right, there we go. Let's do this this way. Wow, this one a lot further down than I thought. <laughs> All right, cool. There we are. There we go. Very nice. All right. Let's pop him on out. Look at this bad boy right here. Pretty cool, huh? This is what happens when you pull this out. Let's see. That's cool. And how do I get the other one out? There we are. Very cool, look at that. That's cool. Just pop that back in here. Very nice. And then look at him. So let's push him out. <laughs> if I can get him to pop out. <laughs> Oh, sorry about that. I'm getting a little overzealous and man, things are flying everywhere. But man, this is a great sculpt. Look at this. Love the color scheme. Look at the tails on his coat. Look at the cuffs, Look at the gloves, the boots. Everything about this figure is cool. And oh, I was going to say, I can't imagine the head moving, but it does. It's like, so that's really awesome. And look at that. So I think that is amazing. All right, very cool. And let's see what sort of um, mobility we'll have here. So I'm assuming this still has a wire here and it doesn't stay as well as the Sonic one does, but it does move and bend. Look at that. Maybe he can do the burning, look. Okay, well, it didn't really work as well as I thought it would. It was like... <laughs> Alright, so let's see. He's got kind of a big ball for a body. Let's see how the legs come forward. So they only bend like way over here, so it looks a little awkward. But, they do come that way and this way. and Overall, they do bend pretty well. So we'll say this. But, I guess we're really not going to be super big into bending him. We're just going to have him basically just posed already, kind of pointing at Sonic. And he's like, I'll get you, Sonic. 
I'll get you. <laughs> Ugh. I'm trying to bend this one so that the elbow and it doesn't bend the same as our Sonic as I just mentioned right there. But look at these boots. That looks really cool. And let's put them right on over here. You know what? There we go. Oh, he's leaning. Ah! Sorry, I'm losing control of this guy. And that didn't work either. <laughs> okay, there we are. Okay, great. I can definitely dig that. Okay, awesome. So let's go ahead and move on. What do you say? Okay, well, I love Tails. I think Tails is incredible. And ever since the second Sonic video game, the fact that you could play Tails and basically two players, that was really awesome. Look, this one comes with Amy, and this pixelated Amy right here. That looks cool. And let's get Tails open. Same drill. Let's see. There we are. Ooh. That one didn't sound as smooth as the last couple. <laughs> Alright, there we are. Amy right here. And there we are. That looks cool. Okay. Let's and let's get our tails figured out. Oh, and this one actually has a rubber band. It's hard to, to get out the middle. Alright, sorry about that. Let's take a look at this awesome Tails, and Tails looks great. Let me tell you, I'm sure the head pops off as well. And it has a little bit of suction when it goes back down. Look how awesome both of these tails look. I wonder if they pose. They kind of do. Look at that. But they've already basically got this shape right here. I don't know if they spin out. Kind of. So, look how great that looks. We can definitely pose these arms way better than Eggman. Look at that. Love the sculpt. This tails looks great. Look at these shoes. Look at those socks. And the legs articulate really well. Look at that. I think this looks outstanding. Look at the hair right here coming out of the face. Oh, right on the for above the forehead. This, um, what's Tails' first name again? Miles? Prower or something like that? <laughs> so, if, I could be way off, but if I remember correctly from decades ago. But look how great this Tails looks. I'm really digging this figure, actually. Looks absolutely outstanding. And... Let's have him just chilling like this. What do you say? Look at that. I'm digging that. Let's move them a little bit closer up. Look at that. It looks outstanding. Everybody just sort of pointing with that hand. <laughs> All right. Let's move on. This has already been pretty outstanding. Another favorite character, Knuckles, and look how amazing Knuckles looks. And this one comes with tails right here, look at that. So, again, no write-up back here, but super cool. Let's get Knuckles out. We got Knuckles, we got Tails, Sonic, Eggman. Still a few more left. There we go. Perfect. And tails right here. Let's see what 
this looks like. There we are. There's the body. And here are the tails. Look how cool that looks. Let's back up over here. Let's get the knuckles. Right on the knuckles. And man, this knuckle looks awesome. Set this over here aside. Look how great this knuckles looks. Man, I'm really digging the sculpt. Look at that. Look at the tail. The tail does not pose. <laughs> and this body sculpt. The head does turn, but it's definitely restricted by this. See? Look. It's got like that predator hair. That looks awesome. Look at this ginormous shoes. It's almost got like what looks like a Lego on top. And then look at these awesome spiky knuckles with those two fists so that looks great and yep look we can pose them really well we can probably even bend them up like this oops there we go again let's see how the legs how these bend they bend pretty well so wow look at that i'm pretty excited look at this so this is really outstanding posability on these. Let's turn him this way. Look at that. I wonder if. There we go. So that looks awesome. Great job with his knuckles. Look how great that looks. Boom! So let's set him right over here with his broskies. I think that looks absolutely outstanding. Look at that. All right, let's move on to see what we got next. Well, what do you say we do shadow? And look at this shadow. It comes with a sonic spinnable disc right here. Spinnable disc right here, spinner. And this looks outstanding. Okay, let's get this shadow open. Come on, Shadow. Ooh, this one's not as easy to open as the last ones. There we go. Okay, great. Boom. Let's get the Shadow out. And... This right here, this super awesome Sonic right here, and I guess that's oh, I was like, where's the rest of them? There it is. So there's his right there, sticking out from behind his head. Thumb stand. So this is really cool. This spinnable disc. Let's pop that right on in there. Put that aside. Let's get our shadow out. There we go, the top part of his head was stuck. Stuck, I tell you, stuck. Oh no, I dropped one of our spinners. It was the Sonic one. Oh. It was a chore to lean over. <laughs> Alright, look at this shadow. The shadow looks great. Again, got that little joint right there on the head. So that's awesome. Look at his eyes, they're nice and red. Again, this one is top heavy from the head. Look how great this looks. He's got this little bit of red trim everywhere. It's yellow right here for the cuffs of the gloves. But this hand is like, Arr. and then look at these really cool futuristic shoes here. So, got like rings right here on the shoes and the wrists, and got a little bit of chest hair. You now here's a character with some chest hair. See some good bendy po uh, posing action. Look at that. And let's see if we can't have him like. I shall have you in my clutches. <laughs> Look at these ears. That looks pretty good. 
That looks pretty awesome. I didn't even really notice that on the Sonic one, but yeah, like that. And again, these shoes right here are incredible. So, poses pretty well. Look at that. Now, I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to hold these poses all that. Wow, that actually did hold pretty good. Let's see if we can't get them to stay like this, first of all. There we go, we can. So let's zoom in over here, look at that. Actually looks pretty good. Look at our action figures, our little bendy figures. That looks great. Okay, well I'm ready to move on. And while I'm not exactly ready for this to end, I am ready to see the last couple, oops, the last couple figures we have. So let's do Super Sonic. Look at that. Ooh, almost dropped it there. Ooh, another Sonic disc right here. So, again, this one we already have with the one that, um, that came with the Knuckles Spinner. So it's the same Sonic. And we've already done this Eggman, so now we just have these two left. Super Sonic and Metal Sonic. Okay. Get this one open. As I mentioned before, Jack's Pacific Toys, and you know what? I haven't seen these at Tar. Uh, I'm sorry, I've only seen these at Target. I've not seen these at Walmart. So I'm sure you can probably get them on Amazon because you can get pretty much anything on Amazon. However, I have not seen these at Walmart, so these may be a Target exclusive and available on Amazon. Not 100% sure. But, all right, let's get this. So then he's got this, where it's got like his hair, like up instead of down. Kind of like flames going up. Set this aside. And this figure looks wonderful. Look at this, his little tail. I like how it's flowing up like a Super Saiyan. Looks absolutely great. There's a little more um, depth to that line right there on the mouth. And this one has this hand going like this. Urgh. Having you in his clutches. And look, you could be combing his hair. <laughs> so, looks like this does articulate pretty well. As does this arm. Look at that. There we go. That looks awesome. And these legs, they move very similar to just our Sonic, for example. Look at that. And the head moves pretty well. Look, a little bit up, a little bit down, and around. I'm digging this sculpt overall. Yeah, I'm really liking this action figure, this bendy guy. So, I wonder if we couldn't. Ugh. Oh no! Ooh, I think I pushed too hard and this just popped off. So we're probably gonna have to super glue that, otherwise it's not just gonna stay there. But um Yeah, I won't push on that again. There we are. Yep, yeah, see it's just popping off now. Okay, so we'll super glue it later. Right now I'll just kinda try and finesse it back on. And his head is definitely like, I'm like trying to get that, but he's definitely top heavy. So let's see if we can't just hook him up with a decent pose so his head doesn't look. So clearly he's not going to stand like that. There we go. Let's just fix the shape of this leg. Dig in the socks. <laughs> And let's see, why is he standing He's still leaning too far back? All right, sorry about this, guys. Okay, and this looks like this. So we're definitely probably gonna have to, it's like definitely, but then probably, going to have to glue that. So that's all right. Okay, so super cool, except this part popped up. 
So we'll set this aside over here. There we are. There we go. Finally. Okay, almost done. And last but not least, we have Metal Sonic. And Metal Sonic looks pretty awesome. And look at this shadow disc right here. So that looks outstanding. And, ooh, saw that coming. Let's get Metal Sonic out. There we go. This one's just cutting through like butter. Sonic looks pretty good. Zoom in right here. So very reminiscent. Look at this like jetpack here, right? Um, it's turbo engine looking deal. The ears. I wonder. I was like, man, these bendy arms look very like sophisticated and high tech, but there really aren't any joints, and it doesn't bend as well as you think it would. These fingers are just basically like rubber, so don't rip them off, but look how easily they move and they don't stay. Okay, so the movement on the, on the legs, it's pretty good. Look at that. Obviously I wouldn't want it to look like that, but it moves pretty well. Look at the shoes, those look pretty outstanding. They're just really like big metal clunky deals. And this like turbo jet engine almost, right? Very futuristic looks great um, this is like a soft plastic right here and overall pretty good I just a little bum that we can't move the arms a little bit better but at least we can move it some look at that so either way this character also does stand better because of this so here we are Go ahead and put our Metal Sonic right there. And let's get our Super Sonic going again. If I can even get that to go in. All of a sudden now that doesn't even want to go in. There we are. Okay. Come on. Supersonic, you got this. You can do this, bro. Oh, I can't get both. I can't <laughs> have him stand and have that on his back. There we go. So we're going to quit while we're ahead. So guys, I want to thank you for hanging out with us here today. If you have not already subscribed to our channel, please subscribe below. Hit the notification bell next to it to get notified every time we have a new video come up. Talk to us in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. Let us know where in the world you're watching from. And yeah, we'll be talking to you soon, guys. Check out our YouTube page to see more amazing videos that we have. So peace. Until next time. Thanks for watching Vince and Gigi's Super Channel. G. Peace.